The word of the day for wealth advisors is eudaimonic. Dating back to Aristotle, it broadly means conducive to happiness and well-being. Today, it expresses what planners can do to make themselves better professionals and individuals as they build long-term nest eggs both for clients and for themselves. Happiness studies are a thriving niche of psychology, behavioral finance, sociology, and economics that is directly relevant to investing and saving. One example, a 2017 paper in the Journal of Behavioral and Experimental Economics found that a state of well-being and contentment reduces impatience over monetary rewards. <clears throat> Emma Sapala, a scientist specializing in happiness research who lectures at the Yale School of Management, broke down the concrete steps advisors can take to improve their services and feel better while doing them. Whether it's learning to practice mindfulness, non-judgmental awareness of and attention to whatever is happening right now, regardless of whether it's good or bad or somewhere in between. Or learning how proper breathing can expel 70% of the stress hormone cortisol from your body. You'll want to read our story about her advice for getting on the happiness track. Just about every advisor is awash in an unending flow of distracting information, meetings, texts, and client emails. A steady assault that saps energy, impairs focus, and stresses you out. But you can get a handle on it and find your eudaimonia. That's it for today, folks. Make sure you hit that like, drop a comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you're made aware every time I release new content. And as always, share, share, share. And lastly, to contribute to channel growth or to schedule a one-on-one -on -one appointment with a licensed financial professional, the links are in the description of this video. With that being said, ladies and gentlemen, wipe ass. Work in progress every day and see success. And remember, when people challenge you, they don't challenge you to challenge you, but they challenge you to challenge you. Accept the challenge. Salute.